Hello, welcome. Today, we're going to take a quick look at this oracle deck. This is the Wild Unknown. It's the Animal Spirit oracle deck. And um, I've actually recently been learning about how um, spirit animal is um, a term that, you know, should be reserved for people who are indigenous and um, just to like keep that sacred and not use it on everything. <laughs> and so it's really good to know. And so I appreciate that they say animal spirit instead of spirit animal um, although I myself for example I've been working on a product right now and I'm using animal guide could to kind of refer to the same concept but trying to be respectful um, so it comes in this massive box here we've got the elemental symbols on the back and when you open it up you also have this guidebook which is like it feels like a book book I mean and then you've got another beautiful box in here for the deck so many options of boxes hi bumblebee welcome We're taking a quick look at this animal spirit deck um so yeah basically the um the guidebook has these gorgeous Gorgeous pictures, these, um, you know, of each card, basically. In black and white, I believe the cards have kind of the watercolor rainbow color on them as well. But it's very much, you know, the style of the wild unknown, which I know a lot of people really, really love. And, uh, yeah, it's got different spreads here as well. And it's got a very interesting reason as to why, um, okay, so each, uh, each card, animals organized by the element, but it also has a really good um, reason for the order of things that have to do with natural selection and all of that. So that's really cool. And yeah, so this is by Kim Kranz. Kranz? I'm not sure exactly how to say their name, but let's take a quick look at the deck itself. So so yeah, so here's the back. So the back of the cards have this sort of like snakeskin sort of um, design texture. It it feels almost shiny, like it almost looks sort of silvery, which is really cool. And then we'll take we'll take a look at this, and um, and then we'll do readings after. So let's see. So we've got snake. I'm just gonna flip through quickly. Tarantula, camel. Swan. Let me know in the chat or in the comments below which one you most identify with. Dolphin. Buffalo. I really love the dolphin so far. Lamb. Elk. Gazelle. Cheetah. Deer. Whale. Fire ants. I wasn't expecting to see that one. The wolf. The spider, the horse, tiger, cobra, crocodile, phoenix, hyena, scorpion, sea serpent, stingray. Some of these are really unique. Fish, dragon, and some of them are mythical too, which is really cool. Lizard, zebra. Lion, golden egg, black egg, unicorn, oh I love that, cosmic egg, We've got different eggs here, the elephant, the moth, butterfly, bat, starfish, octopus, beaver, panther, oyster, Firefly, bee, hummingbird. There we go, there's my card. We knew it was coming, right? Vulture, crow, turtle, bear, earthworm, mouse, frog, otter, owl, shark, Rabbit, raccoon, 
Dragonfly, Nightingale, Peacock, Hawk, we're almost at the end, Eagle. This one's really important for one for me too, actually. I, I see bald eagles all the time and they always mean something to me. And Fox. So that was the Wild Unknown Animal Spirit deck, and please let me know your thoughts in chat or in the comments below, and if you identify with one, which one do you identify with the most? Um, the cards feel really, really good. So yeah.